This is our view so far, where we're going. Anyways, we're gonna go to an old mine area, see what kind of crystals and stuff we can find, if we can find any at all, and uh, we'll just kind of keep it moving. We love you, Ann Karen. Trying to find mines is very interesting. Yeah. You get turned around a lot. Megan told me to backtrack because that was a smart thing to we do. We are not backtracking. Are you kidding me? We basically went back the way we came. We did not basically. The road we came on is down there. You can see it. We came on this road. You can literally see it. I remember this road because of the rocks and stuff that were in the road. You're, I drove oh, the road. Oh, you were over this road. If you were driving, you'd probably remember too. So when we're trying to go home, are you going to try and take this road home? Because we're not going to get home. Yeah, I'm going to take this road because that gutter was there on our way up. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. Honey, I promise. So we're going to try to do another road. The one that she did not want to go up because it was bad looking. So we'll see. This is what the road looks like. <clears throat> nice and soft sand. We'll try to go up the middle of it. I think we have a good probability of making it. If we stick to the side. As in that side, not this nice big ditch right here. I think we'll be okay. The only thing is, we'll just have to go a little faster up this so we can keep up with the loose gravel and dirt. So we made it up that spot that I got out I was filming. The only matter is I hadn't hiked this far, so I don't know what's up further here. You want to stop and hike it real quick? Because uh, that's a pretty sharp angle right next to a cliff. I think it'd be okay. Everybody's driven this before. Well, everybody? There's tires. Sorry, tires. I didn't realize that everybody had driven it. Right. Oh. So much better now. You're okay. So long as you uh, it's quite quite far off the side over there. Mm -hmm. I feel like we're not on a road anymore. We're on a trail. In a car. Off-road vehicle. I wouldn't classify this as that. It's an SUV, I guess. It's a gangly road, isn't it? Mm -hmm. I mean, we've done okay so far. No maintenance required or major service required yet. Mm -hmm. Oh, just slow and steady. It's just like hiking.
So we drove fairly far up and we came to a really, really crappy part of the road. So we're gonna have to stop, but this big old beautiful piece of quartz here is in our way. And uh, this is incredible looking. You can see the rose quartz all inside of here. Just big pieces of rose quartz, gorgeous colors all around it. So we're gonna stop, park the car, get out, and we'll uh, hike up the rest of the way and see what we can find. All right, so we're all set up, parked. It's a beautiful, like, view, mountain, completely way out there. If you guys can kind of see, we're kind of high enough up where you can see the alpines way off in the distance on these shorter mountains. It's just really nice to see all that. But we set up our home place right here. Got my chair, Megan's ready to go, and uh, dog has found very good shade. Halfway. I gave her a haircut just for this oh. matter. Oh. Maybe if I tread along this side and get over to there. I think we made it far enough. Keep going, I might find some really good ones. Forest fire way over there. That's what Probably it looks not like. Forest fire. I don't think it's a house fire. It's way too big. Yeah, Something's burning over there. Better not be. Lots of crystals up here, all over the ground. That's Thomas Mountain. Over there, that's San Jacinto. Over there, way over there. Snow on the top, that's San Gorgonio. So we're in the mine area. We're looking around for all the different minerals. Found black tourmaline, rose quartz, more of that, regular quartz, mica, and Callie's found some shade. We gave her lots of water and she's all shaded out now. You see the open pit where they dug out a bunch of quartz and minerals and crystals and stuff. We're still poking around, finding places. So it's nice being on top of the mountain and just be able to find this sort of stuff. So we're looking and, and I found what looks like petrified wood almost. <laughs> and uh, it's got a really cool shape to it. And in it, you can see all these individual like crystal like things inside. And Megan found a gorgeous piece of black tourmaline right there. And smoky quartz. And smoky quartz. And uh, that piece will look great out of there. Hopefully we can find a little bit more like that. The further we go around this area, the more and more quartz looking pieces seem to pop up. Talk about jackpot of boulders of quartz and crystals, this is it. So much of it all over this area. And people are just digging into the side and looking for stuff. I feel like the boulders have the best quartz in them. We just found the biggest boulder with rose quartz I ever saw. I sprayed a little bit of water on it. Oh my gosh, hello. If you could see this 
this entire rock. It is nothing but strawberry pink all the way around. It is incredible. Like, just look at that. Cold smushed tin cans. You got old pieces of wood here. Some more rusted out tin cans. Being attacked by bees. Yeah. <laughs> she hates the swarms of bees. So the further off the beaten path you go, the more spoils you find and the more prettier rose quartz you find because everybody picks it up where it's easiest. But on the side of this cliff here, to this hill, I mean, there's still quite a lot to explore. And it, some of it's been picked over, but there's still a few good specimens. It's just beautiful out here. Flowers, too many bees, Megan had to go back. Ooh, Callie wasn't doing so good with all the uh, stickers she was getting on her. Heading back, got enough rose quartz to work with. Megan's already at the car. She's got it running. It's wild to think tonight we're gonna be spending the night over at Thomas Mountain across his valley. Over there with smoke billowing up. A little bit more to the uh, the left hand, the right hand side of that. Hope it's not a bad fire, but that sure is a lot of pine trees out there, so. So we'll find out when we head that way. Well, I haven't popped any tires. I got those Falcon all-terrain tires put on my vehicle about a year ago. It held up great with all this off-road. Now we gotta play with it. Up, up, and up. Time to split. Mm -hmm. Right on either side. Should I get this part? Megan likes her beef jerky. I don't. <laughs> she does. Oh my god. We got a big old bunch just like, for her. Adam makes beef jerky and he does a really good job. Thank you. 
down the majority of the way down the mountain getting to more level level grounds here out of the mining area Megan feels fantastic well we got our sage Megan was very happy two nice bundles she got her little one and I got my big one it's quite nice it looks good with the bow and everything 